Oh, oh. So let's let's have a look. So how did you find the, the DVD then? Interesting, uh, not. Yeah. <laughs> Don't bad. fib now. It's not bad. Not everybody likes watching it. You know, it, it it's as long as you're getting something out of it. That's that's the main thing. Yeah. So let's. Oops. So, how about that one? I won't show it all. Hmm. It's difficult, isn't it? Yeah. So, he's going that way. Yeah. So, does he go first or does he go first? Uh, I. Should do, shouldn't he? Because they're crossing over yeah. the way they're coming. But what's the real problem there? Why can't you decide who has priority? Because only two of them have indicators yeah. and don't know which way to go in. What else is on there that might normally let you know? Who yeah. goes and who doesn't? Oh, it's like, um, so if you look at that one and then compare it to that one? Yeah, yeah, road markings. Yeah, so the reality is, in, in the real world, what do you think happens there? Who goes first? Who do you think? Uh, ones with indicators. And... Well, it's probably just <laughs> whoever goes first, goes yeah. first. Yeah. <laughs> who dares wins? Yeah. So if you're in that, so let's say you're in the blue car here, coming up there. What would you do? Stop and look and wait, see if anybody else goes. Yeah, again, it's like getting eye contact in again, isn't it? Just, just make sure that you're safe. Yeah. Um, you can't depend on everybody else doing it the right way. So, using the diagram in question one, does A have over priority over C? Yeah. They should do. Yeah. But what if C decides they haven't? You've got a lock and <laughs> decide yourself. That's right. They're exactly right. And does B have priority over D? Well, it's the same sort of thing, isn't it? Yeah. Just yeah, All you can do is look, assess, decide, act. Yeah. Just because they should do something doesn't mean that they will. Look what happened to us with the, the, the bike he was going to let you go and then the lunatic in the car behind him overtook. Um, look at that guy at the junction when yeah. we're doing that. They came 50 miles an hour and that's all. It's crazy. So here... The position of the green car may indicate which method. Do you know what the difference is? Near side and near side, offside, offside, on either. Which way do you think they're going? Uh, offside. So that way, and then go around. So not like that. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So it's it's sometimes difficult. What you should go around each other like that. Yeah. Do you know why you do that? I don't know. Gives you a better view. Oh, right. Um, what's the the disadvantages of doing it that way? Do you think? Uh, can't see. That's right, yeah. He's blocking your view. Yeah. So there might be actually something coming. Yeah. Um, over that one? You think that's safer to do it that way around each other or less safe? Safer. Yeah. What, what, what makes you think that? Because you just told me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I realised that as I asked you the question. <laughs> oh, you buffoon. So who has priority? It should be Kari. Yeah. But again, that's only if he lets you. Yeah. Because yeah. if he decides he's not going to let you. Well, that's what goosed. I was thinking in my head. Kari, yeah. depending on what I was Should do. Because he's crossing the piece of road that we're on. Yeah. Uh, previous situation with the driver of car, I have to check the car B was not going to proceed before. Duh. Yeah. <laughs> um, the driver wrong to treat the staggered crossroads as two separate side roads? or So would he just go straight ahead or would he single left and then right? Left and then right. Yep, but people don't do that. No, it's <laughs> can you can you think of a junction round here that's like that? Not round here, I don't know. No. Do you know where the the cobbler is on the the main road into Pontefract? Where we've just come from. Uh, it's a bit further along though. Oh, right, that's right. that's like that, and people get it wrong all the time. Yeah. Yep, yeah, that's good. Again, that's it, it depends, doesn't it? Yeah. And what you see is that's the same as that one, but the cars are coming a different way. Somebody coming along will force their way across. Yeah. And just he said, nah, me, I'm going. Yeah. So, oops, let me put that down there. I'll get there in a minute. So let's just, so you've got it all, that's your workbook, but in, in bigger form. Yeah. 
<laughs> is it big enough, do you think? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if I was picking you up from work, I'd be like, you couldn't carry that in your handbag to work, could you? No. So, what would you say we were going to do today? So, today's lesson, it's the 13th, isn't it? Oh, Friday the 13th. I know, everybody's been laughing at me. <laughs> I didn't realise till just now. Tell them we're going to be in Pinderfield Hospital at <laughs> half past four when I finished. Well, at four o'clock when I finished. <laughs> and how did that make you feel? <laughs> so today we were going to do crossroads. Yeah. But we also decided that um, from your reflection from the last lesson that we were going to do moving off and stopping. Yeah. How do you feel about that now? Better. Good. More confident. Good. Um, it is something that we're going to be working on all the time because yeah. we're constantly going to be stopping and starting. So, helping you speed up your progress this time. Um, what, what does W and B mean? Workbook. Oh, right. Because when, I, when you were telling me to fill it out, I know. I thought, well, what's that mean? Yeah. yeah. So, I didn't think. You watch the DVD. Yeah. You've done the workbook oh. brief. Yeah, we could do an explanation in there, couldn't we, as to what we mean by WB? Yeah. You're the first person to use this, you know, in oh, the world. Right. First yeah. person in the world. How does that make you feel? Good? Bad? Special. <laughs> there you go. Have we done any study on the highway code? Is that signs? Highway yeah. Code? How, it's sign, signs and ro road rules, really. Yeah. On your theory CD-ROM, there's an electronic copy of the highway code. Right. Um, and in the workbook, you'll see, on this one, it is this one's slightly different. Um, you'll see that you've got... Um, where are we? That's a brief. It's further along, it's at the end of this little section. It'll tell you which bits of the highway code apply to what you're doing. Uh, yeah. Highway code rule 181. Oh, yeah. uh, you've got that electronically on your uh, on your theory CD ROM. In fact, you've got everything on that one. It's the driving test ultimate. Yeah. Uh, so you can see that the quizzes are. That quiz is more or less the same. But we've added some. We're doing this stuff um, that we're adding in. This reflective question is getting you to think about things. Um, so, are young drivers better than older drivers, do you think? It depends. Mm. So, some are stupid and some are not, and then older people, some are getting too old. Yeah. And some are not. That's right, so it's. it's what, do you, what do you think? A bit of both, 50 50, really. Mm. Is, it, is it young drivers versus old drivers, or is it just some people are just dim? Yeah. And some people aren't. Yeah, some people. When dims their own, yeah, they do silly things. Yeah. And how much of that have we seen so far? A lot. You know, this is only lesson. You know, uh, and how much of it have we seen? No, one on every lesson at least. <laughs> we have, haven't we? Yeah. Uh, how about male drivers? Are they better than female drivers? Fifty-fifty. Do you think? Yeah. How many out of your friends? How many of them have had accidents? Uh. I don't know. Uh, I don't know actually. Oh, yeah, Ryan's had a bump. He got whiplash, but that's right. it. How, but how about your female friends? How many of them have had bumps? Not many of them drive, to be honest. All oh, right. But how are the ones that do drive? Uh, or they having crashes? Do you think? Not that I know of. Why do you think that is? More careful. Hmm. Why do you think that is? Because of idiots. Because of boy drivers. Yeah. Why do you think boy drivers drive that way? Showing off. Yeah. For girls. Nearly always showing off to girls, isn't it? Yeah. Um, because young lads are, are are just daft that way, and that's what drives them. So, it's it's not necessarily the skill level, because they can handle the car because they pass the test. Yeah. What is it you think that that causes them the problem? Just showing off and acting good, mm. trying to do stuff without thinking. Yeah. That's that's a big part of it. Yeah. So says here, generally young drivers have better eyesight, faster reactions, and more stamina. But they're three times more likely to be involved in a crash. Mm. Why do you think that is? Sure yeah, it's just exactly the same thing as you said before. Yeah. So, if you were a male drive, driver, I'd be saying to you, well, when do you think you might do that? When do you think you might be tempted to do that? What could you do? You know, because sometimes they do it... I mean, my mates are always the same. Go on, see how fast it can go. Mm. And and you do. So yeah. what we would then be talking about is, well, what do you think you could do? Let's say, for example, you had a car full of people. Going, go on, go on, go faster, go faster. 
you've got to be able to develop strategies that allow you to go. No? Yeah. No, I don't want to, no. No. Um, good, fine. Have another little thing about that, see if you can think of some more. Have a chat with your mates at work. I will. And yeah. see what they think about it. Um, have a chat with some of your older mates at work. See what they think about it. So, we've already chatted about that, haven't we? What we're going to do if we're on the main road and we're turning. Yeah. Um, so we've already decided which way were we going to go first. Left. We're going to do a little bit of a loop yeah. until we feel comfortable. Um, and then, uh, right, and then ahead. Anything you want to find out from me? No. Do you want to have a go? Do you want me to show you first? I'll have a go. Do you want to have a go on off. your own or should I prompt you as we go in or? <clears throat> uh, I'll just ask if I need. Right, you can. So we're going to just do it. Just we're going to have a go. Wait. If you have anything you're not sure of, you'll ask. Yeah. Just let me know if I'm not doing something. Oh, of course. How would you like me to let you know that? Should I, should I just flag it up? Just should I smack you on the back of the head? No. Should I? Oh, OK. Just tell me. Just a thought. <laughs> When you're ready, off you go. And how are you feeling? We're just Nervous. about to tackle something new. On the, on the corner. Okay. What can you do to help yourself with that? Breathe. Um, anything else? Um, What's worked for us before when we felt that way? Take it steady. That's it? Yeah. Off you go when you're ready. Excellent, you're a blind spot. How did that feel? A bit too other. <laughs> no. We're going to go left. Oh, it's oh. a little bit further up, not this one here. Oh, okay. You see where the... Um, yes. <clears throat> we're going to go left just after that. Sorry, oh. the next one, that's my one. It's, it's after the blue car. Where the white van's gone. Yeah. How'd that feel? Alright. And left again. Yep, we're going to just follow that one, and then we're going to take the first road to the left. So what are we going to do here? That's good. We're already in the gap, nothing you can do, is there? No. So, can we go? Yeah. Oh, not <laughs> there. <laughs> uh, you can't account for that, can you? That's good. That speed feel about right? Yeah. Just because it was. What can we do to help ourselves here, do you think? To get a better view? It, but did you realise what you've done? You've leaned over a bit. Yeah. Gives you a better view, doesn't it? Now if you look down to the... Once we get around this corner a bit, if you look a bit further down, tell me what you see. What, what sort of junction is the next one? Oh. See the sign? Uh, good yeah, We're going to go it's left. What sort of junction is it? Uh, across. Yeah, it's oh, well done. Yeah. What gear do you think we might need here? Yeah. Hmm. Who goes first, him or us? Uh, well, straight on. Uh, good. Well done. How'd that feel? Take me That's it, well done. Knowing what the problem is is half the battle. Yeah. We're going to take the next road to the left. That's good, brilliant. Excellent mirror work. Just 
by that time. Yeah. Just oh, see yeah. if the car's gone up there. Yeah. Okay. I don't be fighting when I'm driving. <laughs> Find a spot to stop further along here. I'll let you choose a spot. Because you allowed yourself plenty of time. Yeah. It's good. Excellent. So, we've gone up, we've just done a left hand loop at a crossroads. How do you feel about that? Good. It's alright, isn't it? Yeah. Why do you think it was alright? Because I took my time and mm. it was quiet. Yeah, yeah. Also, do you think do you think it might be a little bit to do with, well, maybe you know what you're doing now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it's just, all we need to do is just allow ourselves the time. Not like he's just done that. Didn't buy it. <laughs> it's just. So, it's lovely as we're going around there. The approach is nice. Um, if you're going to grade yourself, so what are, what are the component parts of, of, of the junction? Do you think on, on our approach and our exit? What are we what are we doing as we're going up to that? Uh, yeah, mirror signal. Yep, that's good. Thinking what you're going to do now. That's it. So why are we checking the mirror? To make uh, for uh, other vehicles behind that's us. It. And then the signal. To let them know what we're doing. That's it. So, how much time do you think there needs to be between checking the mirror and signalling? Um, straight away. A couple of seconds, maybe. Okay. How, how much time do you think you're leaving? Not, uh, not much. Oh, kind of go on mirror and signal at the same time. Yeah. We? So, we need to check the mirror, decide, then signal. Right, okay. So, if we allow a little bit more time there, yeah. I think that might make sense? Yeah. Shall we try the same loop? Again, we're practicing now moving off and stopping all the time. Yeah. Good. Excellent. Like the blind spot check. Remember more of the time now. Yeah. Good. Started a bit lonely, but you sorted it out. Yeah. Just takes time. You tell me. Yeah. Go on then. How'd that feel? Alright. Oh, no. I think we got a bit close though. What should we do here? Slow. That's good, well done. Well done. We'll take the next road to the left. This one. That's the one. you a bit more time. What about here though? Um, it's we're already in the gap, aren't we? Yeah. So we'll go left here. What more gear do you think we need? One. Good. <gasps> oh, that was a bit. What do you think caused that? Because I was skipping a gear. Yeah, and we're maybe still a little bit quick. Yeah. But nobody died. You did, you did. That's the most important thing. <laughs> what did we say we were going to do to help us with this? Feeling uh, nervous and stuff. Uh, breathe. Are we doing that? Yeah, I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> Have a think about it as we approach the next one. I think what you'll probably find is that you're stopping breathing as we get close to the end. <laughs> Everybody does it. We've got left at the end of this one. Yeah. Okay. Now, 
who had priority then? Goals. Did he give us it? Nah, he said he was going, didn't he? It was fighting you. Yeah. Do you know why that is? Why? A bit too quick. Oh, okay. So it's okay to miss a gear out sometimes, but you need to be at the right speed for the gear. Yeah. That's it. What do you think that was? Um, gas. That's it? Gas. That's it. That's fine. I'm not right? stopping any time. No, no, we'll carry on this time. Okay. Sorry, I didn't make it clear. I want to take the same turn to the left that we did before. So when we're in situations like this, if a vehicle comes the other way, we need to either get to the gap before it or after it. And try and never to arrive there at the same time. Yeah. And that keeps you feeling calm. We're to the second left. This is the first. Sometimes oh, people are nice. Bit of an indicator. <laughs> no. How about this situation? What should we do here? Stop. What gear do you think we need? That's it. Well done. How's that? All right. All right. We've got left here. and just give somebody a doing for not doing it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Excellent. How did that feel? I like that. It's a bit, when you've got the time, everything's easy. Yeah. At the end of the road this time, we'll take the road leading to the left. Uh, to the, sorry, right. to the right. <laughs> yes, a different way to the way we've gone. <laughs> but you work that out. How about this? Oh, that's meant to be Should honest, we hold back here? That's it. Oh, oh, why with that? What do you reckon? Is yeah. that handbrake neural? Yeah, go on. And then look. You do that. I didn't do it on a purpose. <laughs> Just stalled it. <laughs> and when you're ready, off we go. In the first. Take our time. Wait. That's it. Where was she at? Impatient. <laughs> Person. <laughs> All you can do is make the best of it. Yeah. Old people. <laughs> hey, I'm so an old person. <laughs> she were older than you, I can tell. <laughs> Thanks for that. We'll go right at the end of this road. <laughs> Well done. So, what do we need to do here to help us? Put on brake. That's on. it. I'm going to take your time. Yeah. On brake. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Are you stopping? Did you see him flash his lights? Yeah, that's why I said I'm stopping. Yeah, it's not really an official signal, so it's a difficult one. Yeah. See so how smooth we can get this. Oh. I'm still getting that little jump. We're not coming right off the gas. Yeah. We'll take the next road to the left. This one, then. This one, just here. And this is actually a crossroads. 
good, well done. That's it, well done. <laughs> you weren't as close as you thought you were. <laughs> Did I need indicators on that? You do. Oops. And next then? This one here. So I forgot to indicate. That's okay. Oops. We got away with it because there wasn't anybody about. No, okay. When we're going from one road to another, we always signal. Moving away and stopping and overtaking parked cars, we only signal if it's necessary. It's because of nerves, that. That's because right. Because of that other car. Yeah. Well, again, it, it forces you to sort of start hurrying stuff, doesn't it? Yeah. That's alright, that's what I'm here for. You can't learn to drive without making mistakes. No. This feel like the right speed? Yeah. It's because it is. <laughs> Going down here with all these cars. What do you think he's going to do? I hope, I hope he don't pull off. Uh, left at the end of the road. Left. What we'll do here is, as you're rolling up, Clutch down in it the first. Set the gas fight the bike. Here you go. Grab what you cover. So you see how by doing that on the roll up, we're ready to go. Yeah. You can't always do that. That's a wizard round. Well yeah, done. That's not that's that's excellent. Too long, that's... This is an awkward situation, isn't it? Yeah. It's not it's exactly just... the right thing. You can get a look under the car as well and up the inside. Yeah. That can sometimes help. We'll go ahead this time. Straight on. That's the one. That's good. So all that practice stopping next to the lamppost has done the world of good. That were better than others. It certainly was. We're finding my bike anyway. It's just practice. Yeah. Ever think about it? You still haven't done it that many times. Smoothness level there, one to ten? Ten. It wasn't bad, was it? No. Well, it's, it's a ten, but why is it a ten? Because I didn't jerk. Because there's nothing you can improve, is there, really? No. It's Everything's working smooth. So, if we're going to do a little review of how, how do you feel that that's went? That's, that's went. That that's gone. <laughs> how do you feel that's went? <laughs> <laughs> uh, really good, actually. Mm. Yeah. The, um, so the one thing, let's, uh, if we were going to ask you what the take-home message was, as an Americanism for you, what's the take-home <laughs> message for today? What do you What do you think you need to do more of when you're doing these things uh, to help you? 
What, like my book and my DVD? Uh, no, not that. I mean, when we're actually doing oh, it. Sorry, doing I didn't make that clear. Um, my mirror and my signal. And to help you feel better when you're doing it? Brave. Anything else? Tech time. Yeah. When has it been the like... most successful? Uh, just then, when it's been quiet. Yeah. Well, yes, but how about um, when that woman overtook us when she shouldn't have done? Did it work <laughs> quite well then? Yeah. Why yeah. did it work well then? Because I stalled it and I couldn't move anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. I did but stop after that, though. I did stop did. and then I waited and then set off when it did gone. When you set off, was it smooth? Yeah. Why was it smooth? Because I took my time. Took your time. Exactly so. But you've always got more time than you think. Yeah. Always got more time than you think. It's very it's always easier to to think, oh I'm gonna get it wrong, I'm gonna get it wrong. Um when the reality is you get it right more than you get it wrong, don't you? Really? Yeah. So yeah. it's it's all Confidence is in short supply to begin with. It always is. Um, it's the same for everybody. Uh, all we're hoping to do is to just get you in, into a place where it's all just happening automatically and you don't really have to think about it. Yeah. And it's all that basic. So we're approaching the time sometime soon where it'll just go yeah. and drop together. Hopefully. Does it feel that way to you? Do you feel it's coming close? How do you feel? Yeah. It, yeah. It just takes everybody's at a different point, but there just comes one day when you just think, yeah, I can do it. Yeah. Um, I think everything I can. I've learnt more than what I thought I was going to learn good, before good. we started good, doing good. the lesson. Well, it's a lot of it's about about having the right environment for learning to happen. Yeah. Um, for that to happen, uh, I wouldn't normally tell you this stuff, but for that to happen, you need to be relaxed. Yeah. You need to feel safe. You need to feel that, um, and that's what all of this stuff's about. All this new stuff we're doing. I'll, I'll edit this bit out of the video. Um, it's all about getting you to recognise what you need to do, uh, to, to recognise how you're feeling about stuff, um, and to feel secure that if you stole the car, I'm not going to go, oh, yeah. what did you bloody do that for? What did you do? Come on, what have you done that for? Come on, speak up, why have you done that? Um, so that you, you know you're not under threat. Yeah. That I'm not going to tut and hump and go, come on, you've got plenty of time. Yeah. And, and do the, you know, if you make a mistake, go, oh, God. Because people pick up on that. Yeah. And it's so important. Um, and it, it's it's about the relationship um, that it, it needs to be that you feel comfortable, you feel safe, you don't feel like someone's going to judge you. And that you feel that you can say anything you want and you can ask anything. I'm hoping that you feel that way. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, using, using the videos and stuff, I mean, I, I'd love to be able to do that, but I don't want to do it unless you're completely comfortable with it. So do you want to watch them first, or are you happy for us to come in? We're not going to stick it out to the world. I'm not bothered anymore. <laughs> I think what you'll, you'll, you'll see is um, a difference in yourself from when we start to where you are now. Yeah. Um, certainly from a confidence point of view. Yeah. Um, the, yeah. Do you feel more in control? Yeah. Well, yeah. And is it is it... Hopefully, I'm looking forward to, to lessons coming around. But let's start a little chat about the. Did you think the DVD helped or hindered? Is it what you like doing or not? There's uh, no wrong answer here, by the way. It's not bad. It's not like. I think I could do it without, but if it helps me more, then yeah. Well, that's the thing. That, but, you know, we've tried it, and it, when you're doing your post lesson reflection now, think about how, how did it help? Did it or didn't it? And, and be honest with yourself. And again, so we've got a, it's all in one book now. So this is all you'll need now. So when we're doing the, we'll have a look at the targets in just a second. So when you're doing your, your post, I'm sorry, your post lesson reflection, which you hear at the back now. Find it in a minute. Um, you know, what did you enjoy, what went well? Have a think about, did this work and did it not? There's a couple more that we need to fill in. I'm gonna put the pen. Oh, it's in your door pocket. Can you just pass me oh. the, pass me the, the, that one? Ta -da. So, you did the workbook quiz. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's good, isn't it? I did bring a second pen. There it is. Oh, I wish you something's not going to work, is it? 
So let's have a look at our targets for today. <laughs> We're doing well here, aren't we? It's a fine day. <laughs> there. So, we'll give you that and you can fill these in while I look at, look at them in the book. So, what's target number one say? Uh, what here? Yeah. When approaching a crossroad on a major road ahead, it takes suitable observation into each side road. What do you reckon? Can you do that? Yeah. You want to put a lane through it? Can you do it with help or without help? Uh, without. Make that across them. So we can do that at the normal ones? Staggered ones, how about that? We haven't actually done one, have we? No, I wouldn't so say. So, we'll come back to that one. Yeah. So, how about the, the next one? When turning left on a crossroad, I took extra observations until the side road opposite. Do we do that, do we not? Yeah. You do? So, that's when we're turning left here, there's a car here. We yeah. had that situation, didn't we? Yeah. Is that with or without help? Normal and staggered. So we've done it at normal ones. Normal, not staggered. So you might want to take the normal, but leave the staggered one. So we'll, we'll come back to that. Yeah. Next one. When turning right and yeah, when turning right at a crossroad, I take e extra observations into the side road opposite and deal with any incoming vehicles. To what do you reckon? Uh, I did it. You did. I had to think then what I was going to say. But it's, even just thinking about it just helps you to sort of analyse stuff. So yeah. we've done that at a normal crossroads. Yeah. But not at a stack of three. We've done those yet. The market, how do you think? Uh, With help, without help? Without. Next one. When I'm merging left, left from the crossroad, I take extra observations into the side road opposite and deal with any vehicles emerging from it. Uh, yeah. 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 That's it. When emerging right from a crossroad, I take extra observations into the side roads opposite and deal with any vehicles emerging from it. Uh, yeah. Go on then. Don't need me anymore, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Before emerging right at the crossroad, I take up most appropriate road position. Position. Yeah. Go on. Without help. You tell me. When dealing with unmarked crossroads. So have we done those? Uh, is that a, that's an unmarked crossroad? No, you see, we've got a lane here. Oh, so, that line. Yeah, oh, so yeah. We haven't we haven't found one of them yet. No. I don't think I don't know sure if we've got any around here. I know where there are some, but we'll go to them a little later. So. Yeah. Should we leave that one? Yeah. Okay. So. Talk about that at the start, or? Uh, yeah. Did we? Okay, so if we're, on a, if we're on a main road and we're going along, we're yeah. driving on this road here, yeah. and you're approaching from here, what observations would you take? Where would you be looking? Uh, left and right and yeah. forward. Anything else? Behind you. That's it. How would you check behind? Mirrors. That's it. So, so yeah. Yeah. What do you reckon? With. Mm. Well, did that? Who, who gave the answer there? Right. You did. Yeah. <laughs> How about the next one? Extra things you need to consider from a crossroads rather than a T or a Y junction? Did we chat about that at the start? What, where the extra things were? Uh, what was different? Different ways. So we've done that. Yeah. We're now doing that. What was different? We had to look forward as well, Say. instead of just left and right. So we, yeah. Yep. I did it. You did? Without well. You did? I can yes. explain them. The vehicle may need to cross from the road to cross road. That's those ones. We didn't do all that, did we? No, but which, this is just a discussion one. Did we have a chat about it? Oh yeah. Did you yeah. know what was what? 
Yeah. With a bit of help. Um, okay. Just mark it. With help. With help. And the next one. Yeah. You can. So, what do we reckon about that then? Good. Everything apart right. from one. seven's empty. Oh ten's yeah. Just Which the one. we haven't done. So if you turn to the back page, it's right, gets fine. a bit awkward. Yeah, it's a bit awkward because we need a bit more room. Not good writing in the car. <laughs> so crossroads is down here. So one to six was all crosses, wasn't it? Oh, Next one there, seven. Oh. That one. Oh yeah. Different markets, isn't there? Seven was blank. Seven Eight and nine were crosses, weren't they? Yeah. What was ten? Was that just a single line? Yeah. And eleven was a cross, wasn't it? Yeah. But do you want to write just at the side of it? Staggered. Yeah. Super. Yeah. So let's have a little look at our reflective log. We'll get used to where everything is in this in a, in yeah. a, in a bit. It's all just new. See how new it is, I can't find it. Mm. Oh, my neck. There it is. So, provisional plan for our next driving lesson. What would you like oh, to cover yeah. next time? Uh. Cross roads with no markings. Okay. Drop that down. Yeah. Anything else we might want to have a look at? Um, looking at looking at mirrors. Okay. Uh, couple of seconds before signalling. Right. Jot it down. Then. anything else that you want to do um, extra that we've already covered that you want to do a bit more of or I mean obviously the mirrors and stuff. Uh, I think we're stopping and starting is getting better. Okay. But cool. like you said we will do them all the time so. We're constantly going to be stopping and starting. Yeah. Um, how about so if we look at crossroads with no markings, how about staggered ones where we see if we can find some of them? Do you think that yeah. might be useful? Yeah. If we can. The staggered's near enough, we know what we mean by that, don't we? Um, so you can have a look again at the at the DVD or, or at the workbook, yeah. whichever. Um, the next things that we're looking at coming up, up on our emerging from busier junctions, which again we're, we're starting to do, uh, but roundabouts and mini roundabouts is the next sort of logical yeah. step yeah. in this programme. Uh, but if we look at our skills diagram, well, there's a few things we can do along that skill level. It's not in there. <laughs> so you can see we're, we're at this level now. Yeah. So we could start work on manoeuvres, yeah. or we could start work on these things. Um, I'll leave you to have a think about that. I think if, if you want to cover some of that stuff or not, um, or whether you want to just consolidate what we've done. So when you're doing your post-lesson reflection, that might maybe clarify that in your mind a bit better. Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. Any questions? No. Happy? Yep. The, um, something that's that's been very interesting for me is that when we first met, you told me you wanted me to tell you everything. You wanted me to decide everything that's, that's happening. Um, when we look at the next lesson, who's decided that? Me. How do you feel about that? Good. Does it make you feel a bit it's more learning. empowered? Yeah. Good, good, because that's the whole idea. Um, well, I'll drive us back because we're going to go across some crazy stuff yeah. on the way back. <laughs> um, the DVDs are in the in the, in oh, the yeah. side there, if you want to stick them in there. In there, then you can remember. Have a look at them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, they're quite big files. Yeah. Um, I'm convinced that these, that the stuff we've done here, um, it's going to really help yeah. in developing all of this new stuff. Um, I suspect as well that we might get a following on YouTube. Yeah. Um, so it might get quite big. 
Put it on if you want. Right. Put it what? on worldwide. <laughs> right. Oh. I might what? get famous. <laughs> well, you never know. You never know.